Good afternoon. Today we're going to have Toddler Water Park Day at home. So I have to go outside and set up all the slides and all the pools and everything, get the hoses out, get the water running. I have to inflate some of the slides a little bit more. They've been kind of like sitting outside, kind of just like deflating. And so they're kind of sad looking right now. We're going to inflate them a little bit more and then, because Jackson's asleep right now. So when he wakes up, then we'll go outside and we'll play around in the water. So my spot where I'm going to set up is going to be kind of like right over here. Am I bring an umbrella out? I had to trim back some of these branches off these palm trees recently and so they're kind of like sparse as far as shade goes. So I gotta bring out an umbrella, get a nice shady spot going. For the most part I'm kind of feeling like this is what it's gonna be. Get a slide out here, get the water hooked up to all of them. All right, let's do it. Since Tim is outside getting everything ready, I um, just took a second, I ate a little bit of lunch. Tim and Jackson ate lunch earlier. I just had a peanut butter and jelly sandwich. That's typically what we do on just like normal days at home. We don't do anything too, you know, like intense or wild. We just have peanut butter and jelly. So <laughs> I think it kind of offsets when we are at the parks and we're having, you know, more um, like decadent foods, more like heavy foods. So when we're at home, we just do sandwiches. But I'm also having a little hummus and um, these are, let me show you actually. These chips, these are Milton's gluten-free crispy sea salt baked crackers. Uh, these are so delicious with hummus. And I'm just having some of this Sabra pine roasted, roasted pine nut hummus. This is my favorite one. Love it, delicious, tastes really, really good with these crackers. So we had some friends come over like a couple weeks ago and they are gluten-free. And so we got some gluten-free snacks and we ended up really like loving the snacks. We hadn't tried them before because we're not gluten-free. So we had no reason to buy them, but like, because they came over, we wanted to have some snacks that they could eat. And we ended up loving, these are so good. I love these, highly recommend these Milton's chips with hummus, delicious. So another thing, because we've been kind of stuck in the house with the weather, the weather has been pretty like just rainy and gloomy for the past few days really for like the past week it's just been off and on raining all day today is beautiful so we thought we would set up the toddler water park for jackson he's asleep right now so we wanted to surprise him and when he wakes up we're going to you know let him wake up and give him a little snack and then we're gonna go outside and show him his big surprise so i can't wait for him to see it but here he is just napping, just a little buddy nap right now. He looks so peaceful. I love it when he's asleep. I mean, I love it when he's awake, obviously, but when he's asleep, he just looks so peaceful. He's like a little angel. Somebody's awake from their nap. You guys know what that means. Can you throw your turtle outside of your bed? And your bear, look at how far away your bear is. What are you doing? Oh, yes. That's your blankie. Yeah, you love it. What'd you think? Oh, That's your turtle. Is the camera. Yeah, you love that turtle. Okay, you ready? Let's put on our bathing suit. <laughs> yeah. Daddy may do a big surprise. What do you see over here? What do you see? There's a beach ball. Do you love it? You love your beach ball? Were you hugging it? You gonna hug that beach ball? You think the, the slides can hold us? No. You don't think? I mean, no. <laughs> <laughs> so this truly is just a toddler water park. Yeah, it's just for the buddy. A little buddy water park. Oh yeah, look at that. You can put your torpedoes in here. I'll tell you what, I wish we had these torpedoes when I was a kid. They're pretty awesome. What do they do? They're just, let me see one, Jack. Show, Daddy's going to show you how to do it. Was that it? Yeah, yeah. sort of. Like if you throw it in the water, Oh, it like glides through like the water. Glides. Oh, okay. Whoa. You need my help? Yeah. Oh, there it goes. I like how you asked if the slide would hold us. That's like America's Funniest Home Videos right there. <laughs> Every single time that an adult tries to slide down one of these, it shatters. Oh, really? Yeah. Oh, no. And like they try to do it like down a, into a full-size pool and they just like end up on their butts right next to the pool. Oh, gosh. Yeah, that would be us. All right, do it. Whee! <laughs> Did you like it? You want to do it again? Those are your sticks, your diving sticks. You want to make your flower bloom? Let's make our flower bloom. What do you think? Come here, buddy. Wow. Whoa. 
Amazing. Are you ready? Did you see that butterfly? Here we go. One, two, three. Oh, you wanted to hold hands. Look, bud, look. Yeah. I know. Torpedo time. Phew. Whoa. We are all in the little tiny pool. <laughs> Having a pool day. Honestly, I love it. Yeah. I think it's great. Uh-oh, bud, uh-oh. It's so funny because people are like, Tim, you have a, a pool. Like, I, but he can't, Jackson can't like just play in the pool. We don't yeah. have a, like a sun shell. Right. Or like a very, you know some pools have like a really shallow section um, for kids to play on. We don't have that. Yeah. So this is our, this is our pool day. This is our makeshift pool. This is our top of water I mean, park. it is a pool. Do you like it, buddy? Yeah. yeah. Are you having a fun toddler water park day? Give me a thumbs up if you are. Yeah. <laughs> Get that daddy! Where's daddy? <laughs> ah. <laughs> Whoa. Whoa, buddy, you okay? Yeah, you're okay. Get that daddy. Where's the daddy? Where are you going? <laughs> oh. Saying one, two, three. Were you saying one, two, three? One, two, three, go. One, two, go. three. <laughs> oh, I made it past you. I made it past you. <laughs> you okay? He's like the strong man of babies. That's your default. <laughs> you want me to do it again? <laughs> what is that? What is that? The close one. Wow, you did it! Yeah. Yeah. You did it. This is your palm tree. He looks kind of sad. This is your sad palm tree. Yeah, he needs a hug. He needs to hug that palm tree. You ready? Pew! Oh, no, Whoa! You ready? Pew! Oh! I like how when he bends over, he makes a noise like an old man. <laughs> he like heard you do it too many times. Right? Jackie. Wait, is that like a subtle way of calling me an old man? No! You go, I like <laughs> when he bends over, he sounds like an old man. He's heard you do it too many times. Say, Daddy! Does Daddy do that? Say yeah. Can you say yeah? Yes. Yeah. Yes. Yes. <laughs> yes. See? What, what, what? It's a star. That's a sea star, buddy. So the funny thing about the sea star is that we got a lot of comments when you called it a sea star in one of our last videos. Yeah. They said, I've never heard that before. Really? Yeah, it's a, it's apparently like a newish thing. Yeah, because it's not a fish. Right, it's a sea star. It's a sea star. So we used to call it a starfish. Right. And then scientists said, well, yeah. it's not really a fish. Yeah. So now it's a sea star. It's a whatever the, um, whatever uh, octopus is, right? Because of the arms? 
maybe I don't, I'm not 100% sure it might be its own thing okay for whatever reason the name Econoderm sounds correct well, but I'm probably wrong I don't I, it just comes to mind you know what I mean you look very relaxed it's so nice right here <laughs> this is great buddy you're gonna go lay on daddy go lay on daddy look at this guy over here I highly recommend anybody that doesn't have a pool get something like this <laughs> just like if you turn this off right here and you just like lean on this perfect just living your this best is, life this is shading me well the sun's behind a cloud right now but <laughs> right. this is great living your best daddy life yeah all right so i don't think we actually showed you our toddler water park in its full glory so we got our panda play pool that tim's laying in and it has a little palm tree a little sad palm tree this archway sprays water down you like while you're going down the slide and then this over here you can throw balls in it's kind of like a carnival game and then we have well the rings go with this too no the rings go with the panda the there's an inflatable oh, the panda, panda. Oh, yeah okay. there's an inflatable panda that's holding a surfboard and you toss rings on the surfboard like fins we don't have it out here though and then we have this big beach ball that's like a sprinkler it sports water and then we recently got him this water play table. He loves this thing. It's so cool. It's a little bit too tall for him right now, but he really, he really does like it. And then we have our splash pool with our little dolphin that he, he makes like a fountain. And then the sides are also little fountains. And of course our little tyke slide that we put in our splash pad pool. Which one's your favorite, bud? <laughs> that one's your favorite? All right. You know what's really funny? After we bought this, we were at Target and we found this exact slide that has, you can hook a hose up to it. Oh, and it actually and like it sprays, sprays water, water on yeah. the slide. It's a dry slide or a wet slide. Yeah. And we were like, dang it. And the price wasn't bad. I it wish we'd gotten- It was the same price or something. Like, was it? Like $5 more or something. What the heck? Well, there's always next summer, buddy. Right? We could have dueling slides. We could, we're gonna have to get another, like a bigger slide. We'll a bigger make a deck behind this and it slides into each other. Oh, okay. Dangerous. It's almost dinner time. <laughs> it is almost dinner time, buddy. Are you ready to have some fish for dinner? No. no. Two. You ready to go down your slide for one last time? One, two, one, two, three. Go. Whee! Whee! Yay! You did. He said that's nice. Okay, so we're back inside. We've cleaned up. Well, Tim, Tim cleaned up everything from outside with our toddler water park. I'm starting to make some dinner and I had the oven preheating because I'm gonna make some uh, like Parmesan potatoes and the oven just turned off. Stopped working, so, uh-oh. Like, it was, it was still preheating. Hi, buddy. Hi, ooh, ooh, I'm making your dinner. That one's working. Just turned right off. Good times. All right, well, let me go check the breaker. Okay, is the oven on its own breaker? Yeah. Okay. Dad. 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 All right, it was just the breaker, I think. Hope, hopefully, that's all it was. Okay, what did you have it set to? 450. No, hey, so every time Jackson comes into this pantry, he grabs this can. What is this a can of? Let me look. He grabs this can of Italian-style wedding soup. And he wants to play with it. Why is that, buddy? It's not a toy, I promise. You have, you have really fun toys out there. Let's go play with those. But every time he opens this pantry door, he like beelines for that can of soup. Every time. I don't, know. I don't get it. So we got these locks, and I always forget to lock the door, but there it is. Now, no more soup for you. No soup for you. Okay, it turned off again. <laughs> so it preheated to like 350 and it just turned off. So Tim said it's probably a combination of like the breaker being compromised from the lightning strike and just the oven might just be old, uh, might, I don't know. So we're gonna start looking for a new oven. We tried the cheap fix, which was to have the board replaced. Um, I think that costs like 150 bucks if I remember correctly, but, and it lasted for a little bit. It did last for a little bit, but I think we probably should look for a new oven. <laughs> So I'm gonna make dinner. I'm gonna just make our potatoes. The only thing I'm cooking in the oven is potatoes. I'm gonna cook those in our toaster oven. After I'm done with Jackson's dinner, he's having some fish and some little veggie bites. So, so yeah. The other thing was that my timer for his dinner was on the oven, so I don't know how long it's been cooking. Not a big deal, but 
Let me show you what I'm making us for dinner. So I am making some pan seared steak with crispy parm potatoes and green beans and compound butter with herbs. And uh, it looks pretty delicious. I'm marinating the steak right now in some tamari soy sauce, some lemon juice, honey, and a little bit of olive oil. And here is dinner. All the dirty dishes behind this. This took a lot of dishes to make. So this is a marinated steak and that is topped with a thyme and lemon zest butter, some just boiled green beans. And then these are supposed to be crispy Parmesan potatoes, but because I'm making everything in the toaster oven, they didn't get as crispy as I thought they were going to, but I still think they're gonna be really good. So that's, that's what we're having for dinner. But we have another batch of potatoes coming, so there are gonna be more potatoes. <laughs> hey, 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 hey. <laughs> When Jackson gets really tired, he does this fake laugh. <laughs> are you so tired, buddy? That's Demi and Gregoria. You know who they are. We gotta put it far away, though. We can't have it this close. <laughs> Jackson, where's your magic band? Beep. 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 Are you... <laughs> were you magic banding daddy? What was, what was that gonna get you? Uh, On the daddy ride? Yeah. Front row, Beep. please. Beep. Like, I know a lot of you guys go to Disney and do the theme park thing. How many of your kids, like, do, do the magic band thing when you get home from vacation? Buddy, were you were you doing your magic band on mommy? Beep. So, I, you want, oh, so daddy got mommy some Mexican Coke and it's the kind with real sugar and it's the best kind of Coca-Cola that you can find anywhere. And they were selling it at Publix, so Daddy got some for mommy. It was really nice of him. I love it. It tastes so yummy. I'm gonna try to convert this magic band thing into like a fist bump. Ready, you buddy? Were, when we went to, um... <laughs> also, I feel like Coke in a glass bottle is the superior Coca-Cola. Right? Don't you think? I don't even like for Coke, me, so... For me, I know, I, I, I don't <laughs> drink it very often, but when I do drink it, I like, I, I love Coca-Cola. Sometimes I crave Coke, like, when we went to um, Disney Springs and I just really wanted a Coke float, I was just like, I had to have it. Do you know what I mean? Do you ever have that? Where you like need something? Yeah. I needed a it's Coke It's always float. chocolate with me. Yeah, 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 okay, yeah. So uh, my favorite Cokes are Coca-Cola in a glass bottle, then Coca-Cola in a can, then Coke in a fountain, like a fountain, like a McDonald's, you know how it comes in like a fountain? Mm -hmm. And then Coke in a plastic bottle. Look at how tired he is. Those are my favorite Coca-Colas, in case you were wondering. I know you weren't, but I just, that, that's what they are. You know what my favorite Coke is? What? None of them. <laughs> I know. Um, uh, it's the light, buddy. Look at that drool. Look at that little slobbery buddy. Okay, bud. You ready? Let's go. Where do you go? Some people suggested that we give him like a mock haircut. Oh yeah. To like get him prepared for when he goes and gets his first haircut. Mm -hmm. so I thought that was actually a really good idea. Kind of wanted to do that really quick and give it a try. Like how how do we do it? Because they okay, said okay. I have I have an entire plan. You're hurting on me. What is it, buddy? It's the wind. <laughs> Speaking of the wind. Uh, so what we're gonna do is you're gonna sit down with him on your lap. Okay. And you're gonna get a couple of books. Okay. And you're gonna like read him the books. But I can't, he can't sit on my lap when he has a haircut at the place. He can't? No. Why not? Because they, they have do? to, they have to, could you sit on somebody's lap and get your haircut? A baby can, they're tiny. Yeah, but they'd have to go around my head. Yeah. Well, they're not. How, do, how do they do it? Like, how do you give? They, they make the baby sit in the chair and they cut their hair. All right. So we'll sit him in the chair and we'll read to him. And then we'll cut your hair. And we'll cut his hair. Fake. We'll fake cut your hair. What do you think? You want to try it? Let's give it a try. But they don't use um, clippers. They just use scissors. Right. So I'm just going to use my fingers. I think you have to use scissors. Well, that sounds scary for me because I'm not as like trained as them. And if he like has a <laughs> sudden movement, right? I just want to use my fingers like they're scissors. Right? Is that funny? 
Uh, let's give it a try. You got a book to read them? Excuse you got to keep them distracted with a book. Let's read <gasps> things that go. Okay. What do you think? Woody's on a train. So here's what here's what they would do. They'd come up and then you go, hmm, hmm. Probably spray his hair down, right? Mm-hmm. And then they'd cut his hair. That's red. And they would go, <gasps> choop, 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 choop. <laughs> choop, choop, choop. So they're going to use a comb, right? I think so. Comb his hair back. Captain Hook's boat floats okay. past a crocodile. Choo, choo, choo. No, you gotta leave your hands down, buddy. Splish, choo, splash, choo. splish, splash. <laughs> oh no. I can already tell this is gonna go very well. Choop, choop, choop. Carl and Russell's hot air balloon. That's a hot air balloon. Choop, choop, choop. Hot air balloon, buddy. It rises into choop, the choop, sky. Choop. No, 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 because they're gonna have scissors, so you can, can't do that. Choop, 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 choop. Oh no, they're gonna cut off this little curl back here. I know, buddy. You're not gonna have any cute little curly hair anymore. That one's gray. Choop, choop, choop. What about the next one? <gasps> Who's that? This? Mickey's choop, airplane choop, choop. soars through the clouds. This? That's choop, choop, Mickey's choop. airplane. Swoosh. Choop, choop, choop. <laughs> no, he's doing pretty good there for a minute. Yeah. Minnie's bus bounces down the road. Beep, beep, beep. Beep, beep, beep. Yes. That's Minnie's school bus. Yes. That's the one. Look at your little drooly butt. Yes. Where's Woody? Yes. That is Woody. Yes. Let's see. Buzz's spaceship blasts off. Boom! The end. Or is yes. it? That's red. That's the color red. Can you say red? I feel like he did pretty, pretty okay. How long do you think it'll take them to cut his hair? Um, <laughs> 15 minutes? Mm -hmm. you think? Yes. Yeah. Okay. That's the train. That's a red I'm train car. Kind of surprised by like, that's a lot of hair up there. Well, they're not going to cut it that short. Why not? Do you think they are? Yeah. I don't want them to. Why not? What do you mean? What's the matter with that short? That's a blue train car with Dumbo sitting in it. How long do you want them to cut it? I mean, I want them to have like some hair still. I mean, he still has hair. <laughs> That's a, a purple train car. But it has to be kind of short because he's going to grow it out again. And then he has to go get it cut again. And then he's going to grow it out again. Right. That one's blue. I think it has to be the shortest, the shortest stuff here in the front. You think? Yeah, like. Oh, no. Like that, do you see? That'll be sad. I'm sorry, buddy. Here you go. <laughs> you want to comb your hair? Comb your hair. Wow. Doing good. <laughs> okay, how do you think you did? I think you did okay. Yeah? Jackson, did you like having your hair cut? Did you like it when Daddy cut your hair? Yeah? Gently, gently brush your hair. <gasps> tickle, tickle, under, under there. there. <laughs> they also have like all kinds of stuff, right? I don't know. I don't know how they like, do they it. They have for... the, like, the light wands. We'll see, buddy. So Tim is getting Jackson's bath ready, and then Jackson and I are cleaning up all the toys from today. You see him? You have your book? But he was doing so good, and he was putting all of his books in the box that they go in. You want to read it? Okay. You know what time it is. Time for bed, bud. Did you have fun at your toddler water park today? Did you have so much fun? <laughs> <laughs> what the heck was that? I love that he does. That's what he does now. He does like when he's really excited or when he's saying yes, he goes, ah. Did you have so much fun at your toddler yes, water park? Yes. Those are the stairs that go up to your room where you're gonna go to bed. But did you have a lot of fun in your water park today? You did. You had thumbs up fun? Should we do it again? Yeah. Can you point it outside? <laughs> yeah. Maybe Not we'll do right it again. Now, though, well, no, it's gonna, it's actually like getting ready to pour, it's gonna rain again. But we'll do it again really soon, okay? What do you think? Yes. Yeah, I think so. Say bye bye. Will you say good night to everybody? Bye. Tell them. Bye. Bye. You ever play that game Apples to Apples? That's that game where like it says something different and you gotta listen to the person saying it. No, that was Mad Gab. Mad Gab. Yeah. So that's what it's like having a toddler who's trying to talk. <laughs> okay, so we were reading through your comments on yesterday's video and um, somebody left a comment that said, I think he was trying to say, what does this do? Yeah. When he was touching the, the cookie tin lid, he was like, he was pressing the, there was like a flower in the center of the lid, like a flower decoration. And I think you're right. 
Yeah. I feel like he was just trying to say like, what does, what does this do? Yeah. And it's funny because when we are here with him, it doesn't sound like words to us. I wonder why. I don't know. Cause it's so, it's like so much is happening too. Like, yeah. He's like hitting on the tin and like, it's just hard to like pick it out, you know? Yeah. But then you guys are like, oh, I think he was saying this. And then you go back and you listen to it and you're like, yeah, maybe he was saying that. Drum on it. It's a, I think it's a flower. Yeah. So it's really cool. Thank you guys for leaving your comments because it is really cool to get an outside perspective because you're like a pair of new ears. Yeah. You know, and I think that's awesome. So maybe he was saying that. You never know. It's, it really did sound like it. I thought that was pretty neat. I'm going to listen for it now. Yeah. Cause it was very like, he said it once and then he said it again. Right. The exact same like string of, I don't know. Yeah. So. But how <laughs> fun was today? It was a great day. Today was awesome. I was so happy to have like no rain to be just like having a sunny day in our toddler water park. Like relaxing in that pool was <laughs> It's funny though, cause we have an actual pool. Right? But that little pool was just really nice. And Jackson had so much fun and I love watching him have a good time. Right. It just makes me feel so good as a parent to know that like he, has fun with us. We're having fun. Yeah. You know, I don't know. I will say he was very worn out at the end of the day though. He had too much fun. Too much fun, but I think he's gonna sleep good tonight. But also we ended our night watching, um, so in yesterday's video, I linked some older videos and we watched a few of those over again with, um, one of them was the hurricane, which I said was Irene. I was wrong. It was Irma. Ah. Uh, what well, that was the one where we had to bring the mattress downstairs and lay in the like the hallway of the old house. Um, and then the other one that we watched was the one where Jackson, I forget how old he was. It was in, it was in August. August of last year. Yeah. So he would have been like almost one. Right. No, that's not right. <laughs> he would have been like seven or eight months. Yeah. Math. But he, he was, uh, yeah, he was a little tiny baby. He was a big baby. He was 21 pounds, <laughs> but he, um, we got to watch him like trying to crawl. Yeah. I, I feel so like grateful that we have all of these videos, right? Like we, it's just so nice to be able to go back and watch his big moments and his little moments. So we did that. That was exciting. But we also hung out with our friends, ordinary adventures, Peter and Kitra on their live stream. Yeah. Uh, which was super fun. That was awesome. We loved chatting with them. So that's what we did for the rest of the night. We didn't do a whole lot. It was still fun though. Like I had a good day, had a good night. Yeah. Uh, I can't wait to do that again, actually. It was like a kind of a, again tomorrow. Uh, <laughs> got a little sweaty setting up and taking down the stuff. Oh, that's yeah, why it was yeah. nice, like having the water and everything to like relax in. But we can take him into the pool. Yeah. Maybe we'll go in the pool tomorrow. But we have to stay home because we need to. We're we're getting something in the mail and we have to be here for it. I don't like it when when you have to sign for packages. It makes sense, but yeah. It does make sense, but like. What the Ooh. Heck? <laughs> so maybe I don't know. We're, we'll figure it out. We're doing something tomorrow. Good times will be had by all. Yeah. Hope to see you there. So all in all, it was a fantastic day. And with that being said, we are off. We'll see y'all tomorrow. And now it's time to pay the price.